Hello, people of the internet. Look, I bought more puzzles. Yes, how naughty am I? Very naughty. Right, let's have a look at all of these. So, first things first is this one, which I did not buy. Um, the lovely um, cross stitch button, Maureen, she bought this for me for my birthday, but forgot to send it to send it in with my parcel. So she sent it to me afterwards. I then decided I wasn't going to buy any more puzzles because I had enough. And unfortunately, I've got an email from W H Smiths, and their puzzle puzzles were really, really heavily reduced. So I bought these were this was two seventy nine. Um, so all the little ones, all the little 500 piece ones were under £3 and then all the big ones were 3 79 I think they worked out. There was £4 of it but then they had 10% off so they ended up being under £4. So I got this one, little baby Robin one, Robin's in the snow which is cute. And I got this one which is a little, little bit of a squashed box but it's bird song in a pine tree sort of Christmassy I guess it's wintery I love pictures of birds I also bought this one which is the village of Sneem by Jo and Helen looks nice someone's come down to investigate <laughs> and then this one which is empty because I've done it and it's on the board in there which is another bird one which was birds of Thailand that was much fun to do I really enjoyed that um, and then all the next ones are all a thousand piece. So I got uh, Evening Sunset at Parliament, which is sort of like an RE picture of like London with uh, buses going over the Tower. That's not Tower Bridge, that's London Bridge. Yes. And then I got. Okay. <laughs> that's your input, is it? Is that your input? Have we inputted? Uh, this one, Summer in Cambridge, which looked like a nice one. And also, it is identical to either a Gibson's, a Gallison's, or a Ravensburg puzzle that I've seen. Um, I'm going to put on the screen which one it's identical to. So I'm wondering if the WH Smith's puzzles are actually made by... Um, <laughs> Digging for stones uh, are, are made by that company as well because this is the same picture. Then I also got this one, postcards from Paris. There was two or three postcardy ones, uh, sorry, Paris ones. One with uh, like rain in Paris or whatever. I quite like this one. It reminded me of being there. And then this one, gallery on the harbour. Again, you know, for three pounds seventy nine or whatever it is. Even if it takes, you know, half a day. It's half a day's pleasure for £3.79 and then I'll give it to someone else. And then these ones, these are their sort of old style ones, which really do remind me of the um, Gibson ones, I think it is. But I like the look of these with, you know, what life used to be like when we were young and look forward to, you know, stuff on the village green. So I bought that one, which is called Cream Teas. And then this one... Because this one just so reminds me of when I was a kid, you know, Silver Cross Pram. My next door neighbour had one of those cars. Or, I don't know if it's in Austin something or other. No, it's a miner. It's a Morris Miner, isn't it? That car in the middle? Yes. Yes, it's a Morris Miner. And all the shops. And that's a Ford Angular there, that one. Yeah, just reminds me of being a child, that one, which is obviously why they do these pictures. So they were all the ones that I got from W.H. Smiths, which was loads. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <gasps> I then also got... Actually, let's take these apart and do these in order. So next is this one that I got from the works. I'd seen it in the works when I went there with my husband, but I didn't buy it. It's called Fairy Friends. And when I came, I placed an order for some Christmas presents um, when they had 10% off. Was it 10 or 20% off? Anyway, so I added it to my basket and bought it then because you might as well buy it for when it's got 10 or 20% off and it's got fairies on it. And I will, my mum will love doing this one, so I shall do it and then probably give it to my mum. 
Then these, the next two I also bought from WH Smiths, which was over Black Friday when they had discounts off everything. This is Spirit of the 80s. Look, there's Shaking Stevens and Spitting Image and Walk and Mindy. And as I said, X81, this is, this is my childhood in a jigsaw. There's Morph. Spitting image, Postman Pat, Boy George, Blockbusters, the T. Look at it, fabulous! It's, the lighting's really weird because it's sunny out there. Look at it, Rubik's Cube, <gasps> fabulous! So got that one. That one was reduced down to eight pounds, I think, eight pound eighty or something. And then I also got this one. I'd want this, wanted this one before. Um, from when I was ordering from that toy shop and it was out of stock and it's called There Is No Planet B and it's got all animals and it's about recycling and, and stuff like that. It's by Gibson's, I think this is a 500, it is. Um, yeah, so this was reduced, I think it was six pounds something. So I've got that. And then the next three all came from Cloudberries. Now I have never ordered from Cloudberries because they're puzzles are quite expensive they're like 20 pound each but i had this one uh ooh, look. tape this one chromatic that's me um i had this one on my uh christmas wish list and uh i got an email from cloudberries uh saying that if you they were doing a buy one get one free um by any puzzle and you could pick one of four or five different puzzles for free so I had a look and this one was the one that I wanted and this one was in the one of the ones that you could get free and so I was like oh so that means they're sort of they end up working £10 each don't they so um, I spoke to my husband and he was like yeah go for it you know £10 each is a bargain for them so I called those two and then when I was checking out it came up with don't go yet you could have this puzzle as well for 10 pounds or it's 10 pound 99 or something like that and i was like oh no because that was one of the other ones i was thinking about getting so i was like oh that means i can get three for 30 pounds shall i do it uh, and i ended up doing it so yes i ended up buying three puzzles from cloudbury they come so nicely packed in like the perfect size boxes and you also get uh, you get a little card that says hello and then look a badge that says Cloudberry's Puzzle Nerd. Isn't that fabulous? So yes, very naughty puzzle haul. But that oh, did I already show you my um I'm sitting there all around with that? Oh, it's like Christmas. And considering we're nearly at Christmas, I really shouldn't have bought any puzzles, should I? Oh well, I did. You only live once and you can't take it with you. Yes, the one thing I was going to say, did I show you my advent calendar puzzle? If not, I'll stick a picture here. My husband bought me an advent calendar puzzle so you get a little puzzle every day for advent. So there you go, another puzzle haul. Yes, I bought more puzzles but I'm loving doing them. Oh, I've got a couple done. Let me show you the ones I've got done. Look. <laughs> Here's day one of my advent puzzle. There's the advent one that I was talking about. Uh, Christmas through the window. I'm doing each little bit of puzzle on a board there. And then what have we got under here? What puzzles have I got done under here? Ah, I have. Here's the ones I've just... <laughs> oh, I'm so brave. Oh, hold on. I have... An avalanche, this one, which is the one that Maureen bought me, cross stitch button. Uh, I just showed you in there. And then I have this one, the Thailand birds one, which I haven't put away yet, which I really liked the picture of that one. And then under there is, um, see, what was it called? The Daniel Merriam one. I did it again because I just really enjoyed doing it. I like the matte of effect on it, but She'll be breaking that one up now. She'll be breaking all of these up now. I have broke up some of the others that I've done. These are the ones that I've just done recently, so they're still here. So yes, thanks everyone for watching. If you're interested in puzzles, that is. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye. 
Right, so, hello people of the internet. This is an add-on to my December jigsaw haul, because, like, obviously, I haven't got enough jigsaws, but these are jigsaws that people sent me or bought me for Christmas. So, I've got this Ravensburger puzzle, which was sent to me by the lovely Audrey. She is on Instagram, and she is uh, one of my subbies here. And we, She used to be bird She used to be in the uh, colouring chat that we used to do. So, you know, the live stream. So she sent me this for Christmas, so thank you Audrey. And then the lovely Maureen, also of uh, live colour and chat um, fame. She's cross stitch button on Instagram and YouTube. She bought me this for Christmas, which has got a cute doggy. And a gel over the park, which looks really cute. Then the next four were bought for me by my husband. They were bought a while ago. I um, had a wish list of art puzzles and I can't remember where he bought them from. And he bought four of the puzzles when they had a special deal going and he's had them like in the cupboard since October. But he said, that's by the by. He gave them to me for Christmas. There is this one called Paradise Birds. Oh, it's too bright in here today. And these are still in the polyphene Paradise Birds by Alina Skystjuk. Beautiful, that is. And then this one, which is called Milo Pro. Oh, I was going to turn the camera down then. By Rex Ray, uh, which is like Christmas decorations, which I really love that one. And this one, uh, I don't remember asking for this one, but my husband knows I love mandalas. And what could be better than a mandala jigsaw puzzle, than a mandala jigsaw puzzle? And then the last one he got was, whoop, what a mess I'm making. Um, the Moon Voyage, Moon Voyage, Voyage, <laughs> Voyage, Voyage, by um, Daniel Miriam. So this is the third Daniel Miriam jigsaw I've got near. I love Daniel Miriam. And then my husband also got for free this uh, puzzle. Um, it came saying, thank you very much for more doing the roast with us. And it just comes in that bag like that. So it's, it's nothing to show really there, but it, it's a 2022. Yeah, so long 2021. So I think it's a 2022, it was released at the end of 2021 for 2022. So they sent them that for free. I guess it's because they probably had lots left over. And then finally, <laughs> I've got these two. Oh no, not finally. I have one more. <laughs> My mum bought me this one for Christmas, which is a Klimt puzzle. Sorry, that's my socks you can see. And it is gold real gold so the pieces are all have got are foiled which um i'm looking forward to doing that 1500 pieces on that one as well so that's a nice one and then i was just about to show you these two i got these two in christmas sales and i'm not sure if i've already shown this one if i have ignore me and i'll cut it out but it's it was two raven burgers um puzzles two 500 piece ones in one box i think it was six pounds and then this one i got from the work sale um just last week which was reduced to six pounds and i've wanted this one for a while it's the christmas cupboard which i do like these ones you can't see it very well because of the glare but it's the um all the little cupboardy bits and it's by ravensburger again ravensburger and uh, yeah, it was six pound in the works sale. So <laughs> that is what I got for Christmas, basically those. And there's all my Christmas jigsaws in here because we do do jigsaws in here in the in over the uh, Christmas. And on that note, here are the ones that are still waiting to be put away. Because now my family have gone home. These are the ones that we did while they were here. We did this one, and and. There was one on there, but I packed it up and my mum took it home with her. We've done this one, which is a really nice one. I do this one every year and my mum did it this year on her own because she, she's got really big pieces, so she really likes it. It's like the vintage Santa one. And then, whoops, the board's getting a bit flobby. This 
this one <laughs> a lot of people asked if i finished the advent calendar jigsaw puzzle i did i did not do it all necessarily on the same you know i started off well i think i got to day eight and then as i get nearer and nearer to christmas the advents just go by the board and that's what happened so i did catch up I did the last three yesterday, or the day before, when my family went home, but the, the jigsaw is complete. So that's the advent jigsaw. So those are the ones we did. You've probably seen some already, but these are the ones we did while my family were around at, at the end of December. And, uh, oh yeah, my husband also bought me these. I don't know if these are counted to jigsaw puzzles or not. They are basically um, escape room puzzles. They look quite interesting. But yeah, so that's it. That's my December puzzle haul, and uh, the next video that's coming out is my plans for 2023. So, yeah, look forward to seeing you then. Thanks for watching. Bye.